Hey, what's up? This is Dilio coming to you once again on another how to series video. All that good stuff. Hope you guys are doing good today. And uh, today we're going to cover uh, refugees ready or not. Um, I use this angle instead because it's pretty straightforward. There's not much to it, there's not much going on, but I think it's a good beat. And I think that it's good to kind of go over it to talk about some techniques for music production. So here we go right there. And uh, also, if you're looking for chord samples or uh, patches for your native instruments, Massive, are you, a, are you a music producer and you like Massive? You look for fresh patches? Well, I've got to Make sure you check out the links in the description below to check out some demonstrations of the sounds that I designed for that. All right? So we have four squares that are lit up on the machine studio. And the blue one is the sample that is taken from Anya. And uh, what we did was that we uh, beat match uh, machine to the sample. And the closest that I got to make a seamless loop was 89.97 beats per minute. Uh, a key is not required for this remake because we're totally dependent on the sample for all the music. And so it's very easy to just add beats to it and then go from there. So I'm going to play the sample for you in its original pitch and then we're going to pitch it down and I'm going to show you a cool technique that enables you to use this pitch bin wheel or this uh, jog wheel here to pitch it down. And we're also going to use this jog wheel to affect the groove of the group which will add the swing. So let's go ahead and dive right into it. We got this uh, sample here. special note if you need to choke everything cancel everything out you can hit shift mute and it will uh, kill all the sounds so we got this one right here so now we need to break it down to semitones so what I can do here is, is hold this down and then I can tap the arrows as I hold this down but you, you see that you can't you can't do that without holding a sound or a group down so I know it's barely in the shot but you'll know what I'm talking about. So I'll hold this down and I'll turn the wheel to make sure it's on tune. And now we got it to the sample of the refugee song which is here. So that's one way to do it. Yes you can go up here and change the tune here but this is a nice pretty jog wheel and I like to use it. it. makes me feel like I'm on an old MPC or something. Kind of a little bit of a throwback vibe in my opinion. And then with it lighting up like that, I mean, it's just do all kinds of crazy stuff. So let's go ahead and loop that. And uh, we have a clear playlist here, a clear pattern. Uh, we're going to make a pattern and make sure that it's four bars because it's a four bar sample there. And uh, we're just gonna play that, like this. things you might want to know about is to make sure you bring your polyphony to the sound to zero so that it can cut itself. If you do not do that and you change the polyphony to 16 for this sample, hear that? That's not clean. We want to clean one sample playing at one time cutting itself. Alright, so let's go ahead and we got a kick drum. And uh, we're going to go to the basics with that. we got a four bar loop, so I'm going to play first the hi-hat, then I'm going to play the kick and the drum, okay? And uh, we're going to do that in sequence here. Let's start off with the hi-hat. Thank you. 
kick drum and we got the snare but notice again once again if you've seen in the previous videos we talked about feel and we talked about swing and I may go into advanced feel and all that stuff when I do my music when I show you how I make my music um, but in this instance we're going to talk about groove so we're going to apply some swings and we get that so I'm just going to hold the group button down and hit this button right here till I get to swing Ta -da. and then we're going to add about we're going to push the swing and really make it kind of go off so maybe a 65 percent and let's hear the difference So let's give it some more swing. Let's go 75. You know what? We haven't heard a change at all. That's why <laughs> I was on the wrong group. I was on the wrong group. Learn from my mistakes, people. Let's try this again and go back to 65%, affecting the group that I'm actually making beats on. Not, not the beat with just a sample on it. Not the group with just a sample on it. So, let's do that again. Hold the group down. Let's tap to swing right there on these arrows. Right here, you can't quite see it all, but it's there. And uh, not the tune, not the group tune. I don't want to change the group tune. I want to change the group swing. Coming up to 65%. Now we should get some more of that classic hip hop swing. beat made for you today remade from the tracks of yesterday Lauren Hill was an amazing singer and still is and uh, you know gotta give it up to the refugees for making a classic hit everybody used to sing this in high school and all that stuff so that's pretty much it if you enjoyed this video make sure you hit like leave me a comment for a suggestion this is part two of my four part this is part two of my four part video series that I'm doing over this weekend and uh, this is one right there. I'm trying to think about a third one. I'm going to close it off with Michael Jackson's Scream on Monday. But uh, Sunday, I'm still kind of looking for ideas as I try to lock down. What I, want. I want to do something more recent, like something that just came out recently. That's probably what I want to do for Sunday. And uh, all that good stuff. So I'm done talking. Make sure you check out the links if, you, if you're looking for some sound samples. It'll help me out to help support the channel. And uh, we're out here, and I'm going to let you hear how it sounds by itself like this.